A couple was walking their dog here along busy Freeport Road in Aspenwall, and they noticed a strange looking object that was propped up against a pole right here at the intersection. Once they got a little bit closer, they realized this strange object was a rhinoceros head. I was disgusted. <laughs> uh, this is my second African black rhino that I've ever seen, like a head that I've seen. So I was like, I think that's a real African black rhino head. Cameron Taylor and his girlfriend got quite the surprise on their Saturday evening walk. This rhinoceros head dumped on the curb. They quickly alerted police who confiscated it and began an investigation. Taylor says police showed him surveillance video of a man who was pushing the rhino head on a dolly down the sidewalk. The guy like wheeled it up. He like dropped it and he picked it back up and he just left it there, left it with the left it with a dolly. The deputy police chief in Aspenwall tells me they're reviewing surveillance video from nearby homes and businesses to figure out who the man is and piece together where he got the rhino head and why he dumped it. I know that they're hard to get rid of because they are illegal to sell uh, to some capacity. Um, also, I know that you assume financial responsibility of them if you donate them. So I thought somebody probably just wanted to get rid of it real quick. Uh, the easiest way they possibly knew, but on the busiest street in Aspenwall, I don't know. At this point, police believe it is real and potentially more than 50 years old. They tell me they've reached out to the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Services as well as local zoos to get some answers on what to do with it. In Aspenwall, Elena LaQuatra, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.